There's so many trailers. What the fuck? I still can't full screen, by the way. Where the fuck I am? <laughs> really? Really, dude. You're gonna display that. Ray traced shadows. <laughs> wow. Sorry. It's fucking ridiculous. Game does look good, but then again, I'm looking in a small window because I can't full screen it. Oh, that looks fucking dope. Yeah, okay. This game's gonna be dope. I can't wait, actually. I can't wait. NVIDIA RTX. Okay, so what's the digital deluxe? What's the purpose of getting the digital deluxe? What do you get out of it? You get... Forty-eight hour early access? What? Is that on all the bundles? Or is that just pre-order? Forty-eight hour... Wait. So, does that mean if you buy... The better editions, these two... You actually get to play on the September 12th? Not... 14th? That's fucking weird. Who does a who does a two day early access on a single player game? What? That's strange. That's very strange. 48 hour I should have read the next part. 48 hour early access is only applicable to digital deluxe and croft edition purchases. Who does a 48 hour early access on a single player game? That is weird. I mean, how else are you... I, I could see it, okay? Like, because recently the, the game devs have been struggling to find a way to make pre-purchases worth it. You know, people nowadays just, just wait for launch day and they buy it, right? If they like it. So they're trying to bring pre-purchases back. And I guess that's not a bad way, you know? Like, if you really, really want to play Shadow of the Tomb Raider, like... Yeah, you could wait till the 14th, or you could pre-order this $70 package and play on the 12th. Like, where the fuck I am? They're just trying to sell pre-orders, I guess. You know, that's what that's what companies are trying to do right now. They're trying to find a way to sell pre-orders. <laughs> 